Did you notice our new piano? Yes, we have a somewhat of a new piano on Musical Memories, and I'm kind of tickled. The um, old piano was wonderful and had a kind of developed a rattle that we couldn't seem to get out. And so, well, I want to say, uh, well, it is used, this one, but it has a wonderful tone, and I'm thankful for it. We're doing Fanny Crosby on Musical Memories today. mentioned to you, haven't I, that I do memorial services in the city of Chicago, sure. Uh, have been doing it for over 30 years, and I go to all different denominations and actually all different ethnic groups. <clears throat> Pardon me. And I was called to a Japanese service, an establishment called and said, would you do this? Pastor Yoshimoto father had passed away and he had been a pastor I'm guessing he's close to 80 and his father passed away the father was 101 and he called and said Mrs. Garvin would you please honor us and come and play for my father's memorial service and it happened to be on a Wednesday night, and George and I have raised our five kids going to church on Wednesday night. And uh, I said to our young pastor, would you please excuse me? I've been asked to play for a, an old, well, actually a church planter. He had planted churches all the way up and down the West Coast all his life. And at 101, he had gone home to heaven. Our young pastor said, go ahead, Martha. And so George took the five kids to our prayer meeting. We still like to go to prayer meeting. <laughs> and I made my way to the inner city of Chicago on the north side alone. Not too bright for a lady at night to be going by herself, is it? And I had trouble finding the church, and I finally found the church, and I, then I had trouble finding a parking place because there was no parking lot by the church. And I finally drove a little ways down the street and parked on the street. And, and you know, girls, how you walk in the street close to the cars and you feel safer. That's what I did as I made my way back to the church. Now, the church sat right on the sidewalk. There was no beautiful scenery and no beautiful shrubs or no flowers. It just sat there. And the church was in need of paint badly. Hardly had any paint. There was a mom and pa grocery store right across the street and its Budweiser sign flashed on and off all during the service and shone through the windows of the church. And the elevated train went by about every 10 minutes and sometimes we would have to almost stop the service because that made so much noise but when I stepped into that church I 
so felt the presence of the Holy Spirit. People had gathered from all around the world to honor this little tiny Japanese preacher. Oh, there was standing room only. Yeah, standing room only. They had a TV set up in the basement for those who couldn't fit into the sanctuary. People from around the world came to honor, honor a gospel preacher. I was so moved. And I made my way to the organ and I started to play our songs. The songs that we do in musical memories. And it wasn't long till Pastor Yoshimoto mentioned that the congregation would be singing a song. And so I began to play it and I looked out over the audience. And there were many, many hands raised to the heavens. And there were many, many cheeks stained with tears as they dropped from their face. And they began to sing. Near the cross, a trembling soul, love and mercy found me. There's a bright and a morning star sheds its beams before me in the cross in the cross be my glory ever till my raptured Beautiful melody. 